Yeah, thanks, Ashley. And if you're going to go out and about in that heat, I'm sure you've seen the numerous Dutch Bros locations popping up in the Brazos Valley. But they're proving to be more than just a simple coffee shop. You know, KXR and Jerry Rebe has more on the company and how they're spreading the love to our local food banks. Hunger doesn't follow the calendar year just because it's not holiday time, which is traditionally the giving season. There are still people out there who are hungry and in need and our programs are still running. 17 years ago, Dutch Bros Coffee Company created Dutch Love Day, where the company takes initiative to give back to the communities they serve. And so every February, Dutch Bros uh, does a company-wide day where uh, local operators get to partner uh, with local food pantries. And, and so we were able to uh, raise $900,000 this year uh, company-wide. And then uh, locally in the College Station, Bryan, Colleen, Waco, and Temple area, we were able to raise, uh, I believe, 13500 The Brazos Valley Food Bank has had firsthand experience with the lack of funding. But really, the food bank is struggling with um, donations right now and product right now, getting it out to our partner agencies. The food that we get from government contracts, everybody's kind of struggling right now with inflation prices and just the way that the market is working right now. So this will be, this profit share campaign will be a big help. Dutch Bros Coffee prioritizes being a part of something greater for the community. Um, it really is a blessing that we get to tackle something specific like hunger and food insecurity, but also have it really reach the local level. Andrea Uribe, KAGS News. And Dutch Love is really not the only campaign the company will be having. Throughout the year, Dutch Bros will have two more company-wide give-back days that customers can participate in.